when New Zealand is a, is a destination for a Lions party, I, I just think the fact that the Lions have only ever won there and that famous team of 1971, you know, I think that that just adds to the magnitude, the scale of the tour. And I remember he came to 71 and they appointed Carvin James, a wonderful little Welshman, as coach. We never had a coach before. He said, did I hear a rumour that you may not be available for this tour? I think it's time I gave my career a bit of attention because they pay my salary and one day hopefully they'll pay my pension. And Carvin smoked cigarettes and I remember he took a big draw of the cigarette and he blew the smoke up in the air and he looked at me and he said, but I need you. New Zealand probably took note of that 71 tour when we beat uh, Wellington with the test matches looming, the, the players were all in good form, so to speak. It was so intense, it was so hard. Some of the best rugby I've ever seen. And you know, as a forward to give the ball to that back line, was Gareth Edwards, Barry John, Mike Gibson, John Dawes, David Duckham on one wing, Gerald Davis on the other wing, and JPR Williams at full back. And it was absolutely magic. I remember that it took me nine months, and just nine months, almost a year, to recover from the tour. You, you know, I was, my mind was blown. They're bands of brothers, if you like, and, and you know, people talk about them as though it was yesterday. It wasn't yesterday, it's nearly 50 years ago. I mean, it's an extraordinary length of time. And I'll never forget that, it was unbelievable. And we had won, we had won the test series. <laughs>